fact when a woman dominates you you are just like a child because you cannot stand up for yourself so guys are you the guy who triggers her to submit yo what's up my inspired alphas welcome to another video today i am telling you women have two switches now which guy are you and which switch do you turn on in women make sure you like make sure you subscribe let's jump into it number one there is the exciting switch and there's the boring switch guys i have seen this with so many guys out here you are you you are labeled as you know the friend or the nice guy or the or, or you are the asshole in terms of you are predictable guys women love men who are unpredictable women love men who are exciting so you can be this cold guy but you are always cold you are predictable she knows that hmm, you have your own demons that are be, uh, that are tormenting you it's all right but you are predictable over time she knows hmm this guy is like this or you are the nice guy over time she knows hmm this guy is just you know there is nothing new to you but you need to be the guy who is who who has a range of you know personalities let me call them personalities this is what i mean you are a nice guy but you are also a bad boy but you are also the mean guy but you can also be aggressive she doesn't really know when you are stable this is this is this is crucial because guys women love men who are unpredictable in terms of well if you go out she never really knows what to expect when you are in the bedroom she never really knows how you're going to give it to her that day guys you need to know and it's so easy guys it's so easy you need to know that hey this is who i am i am a, i am naturally a very good guy and every one of you is a good guy deep, deep within but there are forces that drive you your own discipline what you believe in once you can be able to stick to your own beliefs you stick to your own discipline you stick to your own you know those forces then you'll be able to to find yourself being diversified that's the word yes you are uh, your personality is on a spectrum that way she knows that hmm today you are happy when, when you are happy she she doesn't really know what makes you happy when you are sad she doesn't really know hmm because she, you are never in the same state every single day i don't know if you are well let me bring the point home just like stoicism the way you are unpredictable it's the same thing all of your emotions are inward and no one really knows what can trigger you to become happy or sad or you know you are just there you are just there so it's the same as stoicism number 2 women know there are men who are going to make them submit and they know there are men who they must be domineering now i saw well i saw this a couple of days well this this chick she is a boss chick like she is very masculine in the way she's been raised she she's been taught to be strong and self sufficient but when it comes to men she's either submitting to other men or dominating other men and the switch is simple the men who are masculine masculine 100% masculine she becomes very feminine she becomes like a little girl the men who are lost the men who are just 
like robots they are just you know they are just there everything is what's the word they are like a flag flowing through the emotions and of other people and reacting to everything in the situation these men get crushed 100% they don't have a say so which man are you are you the guy who women naturally submit to or are you the guy who women look at and they, are, they wonder well they look at you like you are another woman or a child in fact when a woman dominates you you are just like a child because you cannot stand up for yourself so guys are you the guy who triggers her to submit and remember if a woman can, can submit then she can follow you anywhere in the world she can be the most caring nurturing creature the moment you let her dominate you she will kill you she will destroy you so guys where do you fall where do you fall number three she either breaks you or makes you guys and this is this is something i saw once a woman knows your insecurities then she knows that she can probe well well let me put it in this way you might be short and you are not insecure you might be short and you are very insecure about your height then women can be able to probe and you know and make you emotional by testing you through your insecurities and they will break your confidence they will break your self esteem the moment you show them that you can crack they will break you i'm telling you my guys ho oh, you are playing with fire if you are in this game of you know if you want to live a life that is full of abundance in women you need to learn the game you need to learn to accept the fact that guys there is no room for weakness you need to be strong so that she can help you grow she can she so she will either help you grow or or she will break you and pull you to the ground guys women have this power and they do it subconsciously they are just testing you subconsciously to see your strength but you take everything personally so guys it's time it's time to know that there is no room for weakness in this game go out there and build yourself build become that man that you know people think that you are from outer space but you 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 must go through the suffering you must go through the hardships you must put yourself in the in uncomfortable situation that way she can never see your cracks or you own your cracks i know that i'm i'm not perfect i own my flaws last but not the least it all comes down to you it all comes down to you whether you are the lover or you are the boyfriend whether you are the bad boy or you are the nice guy whether you are the the guy she submits to or the guy she dominates it all comes down to you how do you carry yourself how do you view yourself because people see you the way you see yourself and women are mirrors they will mirror what you are giving them if you give them nervous energy they will give you the same same nervous energy and they will bring it out and exaggerate it and you'll feel like you're dying if you radiate confidence they will give you more confidence guys understand it all comes down to you first fix your self image fix the thoughts in your head fix how you talk you talk to yourself fix how you see yourself once you do that everything else starts to change the women that are in your life will build you will be a source of healing power anyway hopefully you got value from today's video
make sure you like make sure you subscribe see you in the next video peace out